Welcome, curious minds today. We will talk about COX enzymes, COX enzymes inhibitors, are a class of drugs that target the enzymes responsible for the production of prostaglandins, which are important mediators of inflammation, pain, and fever. Inhibition of COX enzymes refers to the process of blocking or reducing the activity of cyclooxygenase enzymes. Particularly, there are two main types of COX enzymes, COX-1 and COX-2. COX-1. This enzyme is constitutively expressed in many tissues and is involved in various physiological functions, such as maintaining the integrity of the stomach lining, promoting platelet aggregation, and regulating blood flow to the kidneys. It produces prostaglandins that have protective effects on the stomach lining and contribute to the body's normal functions. COX-2. This enzyme is usually not present at significant levels in most tissues, but is rapidly induced during inflammation and other pathological processes. COX-2 is responsible for producing prostaglandins that mediate pain, fever, and inflammation at the site of injury or infection. Functions of COX enzymes Cyclooxygenase COX enzymes play a pivotal role in the synthesis of prostaglandins, lipid compounds that act as local messengers within the body. Prostaglandins are crucial mediators involved in a wide array of physiological processes, including inflammation, pain modulation, blood flow regulation, and more. COX enzymes facilitate the transformation of arachidonic acid, a fatty acid residing in cell membranes, into prostaglandins through a series of intricate biochemical reactions. Let's delve deeper into how COX enzymes carry out this complex process. Arachidonic acid release. Whenever tissues sustain damage or cells respond to inflammatory signals, arachidonic acid is released from cell membranes. This arachidonic acid serves as the fundamental building block for the subsequent synthesis of prostaglandins. COX enzyme activation. In contrast, COX-2 is activated in response to inflammation, injury, or cellular distress. Conversion of arachidonic acid. COX enzymes assume the responsibility of facilitating a series of chemical reactions that transform arachidonic acid. Through this process, arachidonic acid undergoes oxygenation within the COX enzyme's active site, yielding prostaglandin G2PGG2, an intermediary compound that is relatively unstable. PDG2 to PGH2 conversion. The prostaglandin G2PGG2 intermediary, generated in the previous step, undergoes further enzymatic transformations catalyzed by Cox enzymes. This series of reactions culminates in the production of prostaglandin H to PGH2, which serves as a precursor for various types of prostaglandins. Prostaglandin formation. Prostaglandin H to PGH2 acts as a central hub from which diverse types of prostaglandins emerge. For instance, prostaglandin E to PG2, prostaglandin I to PGI2, and other specific prostaglandins are synthesized from PGH2 by dedicated enzymes located in various tissues throughout the body. Cellular signaling. Once prostaglandins are formed, they exert their influence on neighboring cells. Prostaglandins engage with specific receptors situated on cell surfaces, sparking a cascade of intracellular events. These events led to an array of effects, including modulation of inflammation, perception of pain, dilation of blood vessels, regulation of blood clotting, and more. By overseeing these intricate processes, COX enzymes and the prostaglandins they produce collectively contribute to maintaining homeostasis, responding to injuries, and orchestrating a wide range of vital physiological functions within the body. Inhibition of COX enzymes. Inhibition of COX enzymes involves the deliberate interruption or reduction of the activity of cyclooxygenase enzymes, Therapeutic strategy is achieved through the administration of medications referred to as COX inhibitors, which encompass non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs NSAIDs and selective COX-2 inhibitors. The primary objective of inhibiting COX enzymes is to curtail the production of prostaglandins. Let's delve into how this inhibition of COX enzymes operates. Non-selective COX inhibitors traditional NSAIDs. NSAIDs including aspirin, ibuprofen and naproxen exert their action by targeting both COX-1 and COX-2 enzymes. Selective COX-2 inhibitors. COX-2 inhibitors, exemplified by selicoxib, possess a more specific focus on the COX-2 enzyme. 